In today's demo we'll see how we can integrate IBM BAW with IBM Watson Orchestrate. We'll see how we can create new instances of our processes, generate custom reports, like pending tasks in your work list, and complete those tasks, all from Watson Orchestrate. To show you that, we'll use an accounts payable process, which is what you are seeing now, with a couple of manual steps in yellow, starting with the submit invoice task, and where multiple teams are involved. If we switch over, we are going to now see IBM Watson Orchestrate. It works like a chatbot, so we interact with it easier, telling it to do things we want it to do. For example, let's say we want to create a new instance of our process, so we need to submit a new invoice. What the chat is going to do is create a new task and tell us what we need to do to complete it, like filling out this form to submit the invoice. Once we start adding the information and all the data is completed, we can now complete the task and the new instance will be created in IBM Business Automation Workflow. We can also generate reports of our pending task. If we know the specific step, we can tell the chat which one we want to complete, like in this process, it is reviewing the invoices. So now, while the chat processes the information and we obtain the list of pending invoices, it will show up with some information related to them. And in addition we can select which of the tasks we want to complete. Once we select it, we can customize the way we present the information. For example, since this is a review step, what we can do is block to only read the information and not be able to edit, so we can only approve or reject the invoice. In this case, we can see there is some missing information, so let's reject the invoice. We can also include some interaction for the reports, so let's say we want to complete a different task in BAW, but we don't know which one. What we can do is include some filters before we get the final report. In this case, we can select the state of the tasks that we want to see or we only want to see what is ready, or the overdue ones, so we can prioritize them and complete those first, and we can select which user is assigned so every member of the team is involved. Once it loads, we can now see a broader list, with multiple processes included, and different tasks of the same process. Of course, we can also select from here the task to complete with the guidance the chat provides. Since we need to provide additional information for this step, we can now edit all the fields available in the form and complete the ones missing. We can edit existing fields such as the first name, and enter in the necessary information into the open fields. Once all the information is in the invoice, you can now complete the task. Now if we review the invoice again, we can see how the values are updated and going back and forth between the steps we complete and the two applications. We can now approve the invoice, complete the task and continue with the rest of the process. If we go back to IBM BAW, we can check in the process inspector how the new instance was created in the process. As you can see, all the tasks that are completed from Watson Orchestrate appear like it in the system, and we have all the data provided showing the interaction in real time between the two applications.